this is not gypsy hour. Just, oh my god, sorry, but you can't do that. Gypsy? No. Sorry I haven't been making videos. I don't know if anybody really cares. Lots has been happening. There's a new Animal Crossing update. Jenna Marbles left YouTube. I cried for three days. I don't know. I've been busy. I haven't showered since... Monday? By showered I mean wash my hair. Washed all the other goodies. I just haven't washed my hair. So today's video, I thought I'd do something fun and easy because I have no idea what the heck to film because I'm just such a YouTuber. <laughs> no. I used to think that to look cute, I needed to have washed my hair that day. I'm here to tell you that that's not true. The inaccuracy. You can look cute with your hair having not been washed. And I'm here to show you how. Without further ado, let's get to me showing you how to look cute without showering. Roll film. <laughs> Kill me now. So, I'm going to do a braided hairstyle today. Just a simple three strand braid. But I'm going to do like a pulled back slick look via Bella Hadid slash Hailey Baldwin inspired. Hailey Baldwin doesn't really pull her hair up that high. Beaver, I should say. She usually just puts it in a low bun, but Bella Hadid likes to pull it all the way up. So, step one. <laughs> step one is brush your hair out. You really want it to get as slick up top as possible so it holds. Especially if you have bangs that you cut a month ago and fully regret. <laughs> That's me. I find doing this with a small brush works better because you have more control, getting everything nice and slicked. And the tighter you get it, the better. If you have like curly hair and you get these little like curls happening, it starts to look a little bit less model, more I didn't shower. <laughs> I'm trying to get it rather high because that's just what works best for my personal face shape. Now, I don't know what works best for your personal face shape, but you can figure that out by yourself. I'm just going to take a black hair scrunchie and pop that up like such. We're going to fasten her in and tighten. Perfect. I do have bangs that like to pop out if I am out and about hustling on the Toronto streets. And by hustling, I mean walking fast and going to my zero waste grocery store. <laughs> so I'm not hustling. Whoops. Okay. Now I'm going to do the braid. Y'all know how to braid because you're not silly. And um, you're also not two. And so you just do your three strand braid all the way down. And I always just go until I run out of one specific strand of the three. Oh, oh. So as tight as you possibly can get that bottom honker. Honker. Like, oh my god, stop talking. Like, what the heck? Literally did this last night and I was like, I am amazing. And today I'm like, why are you alive? I just like to kind of stretch my braid out a little bit at the top. There. So your hair is done. No. It's a great not shower look because it's greasy looking, but it's supposed to be. That's the point of the aesthetic, you know? Ooh, 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 ooh. Oh, goodness. Second step is actually washing your face. When you can't or don't want to shower, washing your face in a sink is of the utmost importance. I'll bring you into my bathroom. <laughs> ooh, ew. Welcome to my bathroom. This is all you get to see because it's not clean. Now we must wash our faces so that we look beautiful without having showered. Here's my soap. <laughs> Face wash soap. I'm zero waste. <laughs> Sorry. Cue <Few> music. <laughs> Wipe your face off with a towel. Great. Now, like I've been saying, I think it's super... <laughs> I think it's super important if you can't shower or don't want to, to exfoliate. You exfoliate off the dead skin cells, you don't feel as gross, and in essence, don't look as gross. This is Cocoon Apothecary Petal Purity. One pump will do you good. Mm. And one more time. As of lately, since I wear a mask all day at work and everywhere else in Ontario slash Toronto because it's a bylaw now, <laughs> I'm breaking out underneath of it, so like all along this area, it's not a good time. 
Finding exfoliation is helping me specifically. While it's trying to look cute without washing your hair slash showering, you need to moisturize so it doesn't look like your face is crusty, rusty, or dusty. So, put on your moisturizer. Upward strokes, ladies and gentlemen. Gently pressing. That's how you apply my moisturizer. No rubbing, no loosening of the skin, tapping like such, and pressing in. That's how you do it. Always bring your moisturizer down onto your neck, pressing in upward motions. If you're not moisturizing your neck, then you're doing it wrong. Because we're gonna be like 60 someday, and we're gonna be like, our face is looking beautiful because we moisturized. And our necks are gonna be gross because we never moisturize them. Your face ends here, okay guys? Now, last but not least, please put on your sunscreen for your days that you don't shower, and the days that you do, and the days that you wash your hair, and the days that you don't. The days that it's sunny, and the days that you sit inside, under your covers, in the bed, the sun will still get you. So put your sunscreen on all the time. Boop, middle of winter, middle of summer, middle of the night, put your sunscreen on. I am so funny, oh my god. Next step is makeup, get ready. Now, step one, we're just gonna do a little bit of concealer, a little bit of oil, pop that under the eyes so that we don't look disgusting. Ah, see, I already look a million times more awake. That's great. Just evening out that skin tone that's not so even because of the pandemic. It's ruining lives and my skin. So now we powder. Here's a little bit of information for you. I'm that oily that I can put all of this powder on my face and two hours later, <laughs> I will be oily once more. Bronzer. So I'm gonna put tons of this on and you're gonna get disgusted, but it's fine. And we are just dusting it on the temples, guys. I don't wanna look contoured, I just wanna look bronze. Like I didn't try contouring. That is everybody's goal, I'm assuming. I'm really hard on this nose bronze though, but we all know that and I kinda of messed that up. And with bronzer again, bring it down onto your neck like I'm not doing, but do it because you're gonna look dumb if you don't. So remember guys, it's Thursday and I haven't showered since Monday. So when you're like, oh my gosh, she looks so cute. This can be you. <laughs> you don't have to shower. <laughs> and you want to disguise the fact that you haven't showered in one million years. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna put sparkles on. <laughs> so they're like, oh my God, your eyeshadow is so pretty. And they just miss the hair completely. That's the goal. Get ready for this to look awful. So I'm just doing a little dot right in the corner of the eye. Now I'm going in with the sparkle and just putting it over top. So you just put two little dots of sparkle right in the corner there. You probably can't see it because you're too far away, but it looks great. Blush. Put it in the blush spot. Lots of blush distracts from the gross hair. But we are starting to actually kind of look cute. We will do a shiny lip. Yeah. Ooh, ooh, ooh. For a very long time in my life, I didn't think that this was possible, but growing up, I have learned you can be lazy, not shower, and still look cute as ever. Thank you so much for watching. Let me know if you love my idea. If you didn't like it, don't let me know. Just kidding. You can still tell me. <laughs> I hope you're having a great week, and I hope to see you again next week as well. Catch you later.